very important role in life of you know every kid and uh, uh, they are the first one you know who come to know about what we really want to do in our life so they play a very vital role you know in terms of you know shape getting our dreams you know shaped up uh, what sort of problems normally you know youngsters uh, they address to you when you know you have uh, you know any uh, speaking engagement or seminar or workshop or when you know they flock around you and try to ask you ben we want to be somebody like you but my parents don't really you know uh, support me to you know follow up my dreams so what would you advise to parents you know uh, how do you see this situation and how would you like to advise parents about this i would just tell the parents to be more be more cognizant on what you say to your to, to your uh, to your children try to try to invest more in what your children uh what excites them you know the thing about the parents they came up in a different age than the kids do so they're not they're not speaking the same language and the biggest thing i tell parents is your child is the dreamer you as a parent can be the dream killer don't be a dream killer just because you don't understand what your child want to do just because it's not something that you will see that they're doing for themselves just be supportive you don't always got to understand what a kid wants to do especially your kid but don't kill that dream just because you don't understand just support them and that support will elevate them to, to new heights because a lot of times when, you know, every kid, no matter who they are, no matter how old they are, you want to, you want your parents to be proud of you. You want their approval. And when you don't get that approval, it kind of kills not just your dreams, but your motivation, your drive, your ambition. So I always tell parents, just be supportive. Love your child, support your child. And just because you don't understand what he or she wants to do, don't demean them just because it's not something you would want to do. Just support them in spite of. Wonderful thing that you have, you know, given advice to, uh, you know, parents that, at least you know give a chance for you know talent to really sprout out but uh, sometimes what happens when the problem is not only just you know uh, towards parents uh, what how would you you know like to recommend to the to those people you know youngsters how can they take you know uh, their parents into uh, you know confidence what happens is that you know uh, kids being very young they're not a, having a very decisive mind sometimes you know they uh, tend to you know lose the trust of the parents so the problem 100% cannot be pushed to the parents what would you like to advise to the younger younger minds you know who really want to do something and achieve a status in their life and they are not getting a support from parents how can they you know uh, build that faith and communication channels to be open between parents so that parents understand so that the problem cannot be only pushed to the to the parental side but also your advice about this to the younger minds I would just tell them that I would just tell them that your parents ain't gonna always understand. Like sometimes the misunderstanding is the only way your parents gonna understand what you're trying to do. You can't get so caught up in their approval all the time. Sometimes overcoming uh, the opinions and the feedback and criticism of your parents is gonna be the biggest hurdle for a lot of young people. I mean, especially when we grew up in an era that where we just seek that approval of them. But just because your parents don't approve of what you're trying to do doesn't mean it's not worth doing it. Correct. Uh, my next. So, you know, yeah, so correct. That, that's what I would tell. Correct. My next uh, 